please let us know a little bit more about your uh, natural hair care line, Melanin Hair Care. And what's the inspiration behind that? Oh my goodness, the inspiration was a community. Uh, Melanin Hair Care was really birthed out of the community and need for it. I really grew up online sharing homemade hair products and remedies and a lot of people either didn't have access to the ingredients or didn't have time to make it or when they did make it, it wasn't coming out right and so they were really asking us to make these products and so it was six years in the making of trying to figure out how to make it non-toxic and how to stick to the roots of what the actual formulations were and also how to keep it affordable because we really do believe that everybody afford, uh, everyone should be able to afford high quality products and so that's the history. It was really born out of the community. Right, I love that. And tell us, in what ways do you celebrate, you know, black beauty? Every day. <laughs> I think just waking up and um, feeling like you can walk out of the house without being done up and still feeling beautiful or, or feeling like your hair in its natural state and your face and your body and all of its natural, whatever you have going on is celebrating black beauty because at the end of the day, we were always told that everything about us was not beautiful. So when you're walking out of the house and you are being confident in that, that's celebrating black beauty. And what are some takeaways you hope to gain from the uh, from the docu series tonight? I am so excited to just get more in depth into the stories of the other influencers and the celebrities, and just seeing um, you know details about because you know we have the overall view, but just really seeing what was really behind. Um, the stories that they shared and, and their intentions of um, what they were doing online, whether it was uh, makeup or hair and whatnot. Well, enjoy the rest of the night. Thank you so much for stopping by. You look beautiful too, by the way. First of all, You're congratulations welcome. on your night tonight. How are you feeling? I feel grateful. I feel very grateful. It is hard to get stories made that center black women. Um, and so to be here tonight to see this story that not only centers black women, centers our beauty, which are not things that are normal for us. Um, I feel very grateful. Please walk us through that moment where you were like, I'm gonna make a docuseries and like highlight why it's important to celebrate black beauty in the industry. Yeah, you know, I'm constantly inspired by black beauty, like on just my day to day, like just seeing a woman on the street, I'm inspired. So it was kind of a no brainer. It would just be in my head, like over and over again, like the things I was seeing. And I kept thinking, I'm like, there's many girls like me that are fans fans of the space. Like, I was saying this today, I'm like, I could go to a hair salon, just watch people get their hair done, and it would be a relaxing day for me. Like, I actually love beauty. So it was just kind of like, as someone who is in the entertainment space, I know what I, like, that black women are the trendsetters, I know that we are the popular media, but I don't see it reflected. I don't see people giving us our props. That I was like, I need a story to show that. And so, in comes the black beauty effect. Please tell us, what are some takeaways you hope for your viewers to get from watching the docuseries? I honestly hope people are inspired to be a game changer in their own life. We highlight the game changers of this space, and I think that no matter what industry you're in, you should be inspired to also be like, I can carve out a space for myself. Like, it doesn't have to be conventional. It can be unique. I can, I can fill a gap. And I think coming out of this documentary, people will see that for themselves. Well, I'm so excited to see this. I'm looking forward to seeing it. Thank you so much for creating this project. I'm really looking forward to everything. You look beautiful. And one more question. What makes you regal? What makes me regal? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Um, what makes me regal is my confidence in myself and my abilities and my place in the world. I think when you have that sense of self, you naturally become very regal. Yeah. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Niaz Marie, with Young, Bold, and Regal, and we are here at the Black Beauty Effect premiere here at the Los Angeles Regal Theater. It's only right that we're here. Tune in and stay tuned for more updates. Right after that. You guys look at Mark right, right here. Hold up.